In today's Q-tips, I thought about teaching you guys a very simple transition technique and it's called speed ramp transition. All it is is that you just have one speed ramp going into another speed ramp and it just changes the scene magically. So here's how it's done. Bring your footage into any of your non-linear editing software. In this case, I'm using Final Cut Pro, but you can use any software, it doesn't really matter. Now, once you've trimmed the footage, select where you want the speed ramp to begin. Press Shift B and start to adjust the speed of the second half of the clip. In this case, I usually speed it up really fast, sometimes from 10,000 to 20,000, just to make the effect look really more pronounced. But it really depends on your footage. If your footage is already fast to begin with, you don't really need to speed it up that quickly. So you really have to use your eye and judgment to figure out what's the best speed for this. So once you're done with the speed ramp of the first clip, now bring over the second clip and now do exactly the same thing that you did for the first clip. Once you've done with the speed ramp of the second clip, now all you've got to do is place the second clip where the speed ramp begins on the first clip and that's basically it it's that easy now to make the speed ramp look a lot better you can also add some motion blur and also add some sound to make it more convincing and that's basically it you have just made yourself a speed ramp transition so if you did find this quick tip useful please don't forget to like share and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next q-tips